If you're thinking about jumping from a gas guzzler into a more fuel efficient car, but you're not sure about how much you might really save every week, month, or year, well, the MPG Omatic Calculator is here to make it super simple. You don't have to fiddle with the math. All you need to do is plug in the numbers. Those numbers are the cost per gallon and the miles per gallon of the new and old car and the number of miles driven. So I'm going to plug in a cost per gallon of $3.75. Now know, gas has been more, gas has been less, but that's eh, a good number. And then we're going to go to the next field, to the mile per gallon field, and you'll see 375 was instantly copied down to the new car. So we're going to go to the miles per gallon field, and we're going to say your old vehicle was 18 miles per gallon. It's a gas guzzling SUV. And that you travel 20,000 miles, which is kind of a lot, but hey, plug in your numbers and see how they work out. All we do is pop to the next field and instantly you'll see the cost per mile and total cost at 375 per gallon in an 18 mile per gallon vehicle over 20,000 miles your cost per mile is 20.8 cents per mile and your total cost let's say this is over a year is four thousand one hundred and sixty dollars that's a big chunk of change now let's plug in the numbers for the new car we're going to leave 375 as a cost per gallon because we'll assume that it's the same type of fuel. If you were going from regular to premium or regular to diesel, there would be differences. But for the time being, we're going to stick with this 375. And all we're going to do is change the miles per gallon. And we'll plug in a fairly high number. We'll say 40 miles per gallon over 20,000 miles. Click in the field and bam, there it is. Your cost per mile is 9.4 cents. And your total cost is $1,880. Check out that savings, $2,280. That's nearly $200 a month. That's kind of a lot. Now, let's try some different numbers. Let's say you only drive 17,000 miles. And you'll see the numbers instantly update. Click in a new field, and there they are. You'll see your total cost go down for both the new car and the old car. And you'll see the total savings go down as well because hey, you're just not driving as many miles. Now I'm going to show you that, that difference in fuel price. So we're going to go to the cost per gallon field. And let's say your new vehicle needs $4 per gallon fuel. And it, it still gets 40 miles per gallon. So right now your total cost over here is jumped up to 1700 so if you go from a vehicle that uses regular to a vehicle that requires premium or requires diesel fuel you can expect to pay more than than what you were used to but still you could see overall hopefully we'll see overall cost savings here's what you got to do you've got to plug your numbers into these mile per gallon fields you've got to plug your numbers into the miles driven fields so that you can determine whether that new car is really going to pay off. One last thing, up here in the top right corner, see where it says MPG? If you're north of the border and you want to figure out your KPL, you just toggle between the two by clicking on that button. And that way you can see your kilometers per liter. Catch you down the road.